10 years more to the story. A man killed while crossing I-94 in Allen Park, hit and killed. 10 years later, a twist we did not see coming. A father on Detroit's east side reaching out to us, wanting you to hear his story about his son. It was almost exactly 10 years ago when Torian Brinson was running on I-94 when he was hit and killed. Drivers <laughs> involved stopped as MSP investigated, but it's the reason why Brinson was running that has haunted his dad for a decade now. He wanted to speak with Sean Lay, and Sean, you were there to listen. What did he say? Absolutely. Three things Rudy Brinson wants all of us to know. One, number one, he wants to be heard on this 10 years after he lost his son. Number two, he says his son never drove, never went to the area where he was stopped and then killed on the interstate. That's Allen Park. Number three, he says he was running on the interstate and he says he's getting information now that he was running from someone. He was my son. You know, he had a family that loved him. We want to know what happened. Rudy Brinson reached out to me wanting someone to simply listen to him. Nearly 10 years ago, November 9th, 2014, Brinson's 27-year-old son, Torian Brinson, was running across I-94 near Oakwood Boulevard in Allen Park. Other drivers did not see Torian hitting him. Brinson was killed. Those drivers stopped as MSP investigated. The drivers were not at fault. Initial reports were that Brinson had a flat and ran across 94 and was hit running back to his car. But Rudy Brinson has dug into reports that indicate his son was driving at a high rate of speed on three rims, three flats, in an area he never went to. What the police report was saying that he was riding miles and miles on a, on a bare rim going as fast as he could. That something thing, was wrong. Yeah, something was wrong. That's as a father. You feel that, that something was wrong and you want someone to look into that. It's been 10 years. And over the years, some information has come to him that shows his son was running from someone. So the question is, what was he running from, from. or what was he running to? He was running from something. Something or somebody. Somebody. That's got to bother you that police don't have it. Yeah, it's, it bothered me. That's why I'm talking to you. All right, so back here live again, this isn't something father's intuition or what his gut is telling him that his son was running from someone or was taken down to Allen Park in that area. It's information, bits and pieces he's been getting over the years trying to string together. So the case of the him being hit on the highway is closed, but he needs a tip to get things going with MSP or other police agencies to reopen the case to have another look at it. So he's hoping someone sees this and gives MSP a call or gives even him a call. We're live tonight, Sean Lay, Local 4. Yeah, back let's to you. hope that happens to give him hopefully some closure. All right, Sean, we appreciate it.